Hi there. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to use PHP MySQLi interface to connect with a database. So you have two options here. You can use object oriented programming way to access your database or you can use procedural way to access that database. So we will go with object oriented method of going towards our database and fetching that data okay so let's start by creating our first variable that will create instance of mysqli class within which we are going to access localhost then we are going to access our username then password and at the end our database name for me the name of database is test and if you go through your database you can also get the table name which I have made for my local server you can create your own and make sure it has some sample data okay so we have that database name here once you do that simply create condition within if type in mysql i calling for connect underscore now after that we will simply call for die method which will call for error and it will also point out that particular error for that we simply use mysql i connect underscore error simply error number if you want and then outside this method we will also have one more class to call my supply and then connect underscore error okay and then we will simply close it okay after that we will have else condition and inside this condition we will type in echo database connected or connected to database whichever you want so here let me explain again I created a new class by passing localhost root password and database name and that instance or you can say that class instance is checking for connector and if there is any then we will use time method for error okay simply type in that here and then my sql i connect error will display the error number and also it will append connect error so the thing is like we are mentioning error in words and then number and with specific error so that you can read properly okay so let me go here and execute our program as demo.php we'll see whether it is connected or not and it is loaded and shows the message connected to database Okay, so in case of let's say change of database name here what will happen if I do that so if I do that it will simply show the error message okay so error error number specific error it is displayed here so you just have to go here and make things 
okay then it will load properly so now you know how to use op to connect to the database